shallow rocks pit top. Not quite at the summit, but not far off. Bit of a wander, and here we go. Well, got here anyway. Grab my balance. Fair old height for RF takeoff. This is what we're running, little antenna built for uh, 435 megs. Working on the uh, PMR 446 receive at the moment. This is a camera rig or used for disco lighting. Flag, Shag. You want Shag? Flag, Foxtrot, Lima, Alpha, Golf. What's he say, Andy? Flag. Who is? Flaggy. Well, here we are. Shire Oaks pit top. Nobody but me in the clouds. A couple walking away there. And this. This is cut for 435 meg and we're on the top of the pit tip. I'm going to try and get a better view of that without getting blinded by the sun. It's just a ground plane antenna is what it is. And we built this a few days ago. Tested it from home on the ground so now I'm going to get it up in the airwaves. We're going to give this a test on 70 centimetres, which is what it was cut for. It was cut for four, three, five megs, this antenna. So hopefully we'll get some good results on that. I'm just going to bit of, uh, enough, put my teeth in, get a bit of video of the antenna that we're using, and then we'll come back and try an on-air test. Lovely clear skies and clear around me so I've got a nice clear open shot pretty much in one big circle from this location what are you up to Andrew? no just mute to tell the gosh music run and he can't have music in background on this frequency why is that babe? because it's copyright Right, have you uh, got us okay in here? Can I know you have, mate? I'm just doing a bit of video, mate. So, uh, got you both on here. M0 Golf Echo Tango to M7 KWK. Yeah, Mike, 7 kilo, whiskey kilo returning, Paul. Yeah, you're coming through really good, mate. Got a signal. Really good signal. Um, yeah, plus 10 radio, 5, no trouble. I'll pass it over to 2E0 SGI. Is that, yeah, right. yeah, with you, Andrew. Yeah, 2E0 SGI. Yeah, mate, yeah, you gave me 9 now for some reason. Radio 5. Yeah, I've not changed anything, mate, at all. I've left it as it is. M0 Golf Echo Tango returning. As I say, Andy, it's just a little ground plane antenna. So it's cut for 435 meg, but it'll work a bit further up, if you get what I mean. Yeah, yeah. I know what you mean, mate. Nice little thing you've done, man, isn't it? Nice little job you've done on it. I used to love making these when I first started in radio, mate. <laughs> I used to make them for all sorts of bands and uh, quite uh, quite enjoyed the winner, mate. Thank you very much for a quick report, guys. I'm going to have a listen around, see what other repeaters I can find on here while I'm up here, see if that's any good to me. Yeah, OK, mate. We'll go back to where we were before. Number eight, yeah. And we'll listen out for you. I hope you enjoy yourself up there. Yeah, I'm going to go for two metres in a little while. I've just got to swap antennas. I've got a little super gainer with me. So I'm going to try uh, 144600 in a little while. Yeah, there, we'll go there. Can we go to 144600 and we'll monitor, Andrew? What FM, Paul? Yes, yes, I can work Fusion if you want. I've got a Fusion radio with me. We'll go FM, yeah? Okie doke, it means everybody can join in then if anybody else calls in. Okie doke, guys, 7-3 for now, M0 Golf Echo Tango. This is an antenna I'm going to be using up here for 2s and 70s. Straight out of the packet. Years old, never been used. Gets its uh, first use today. Transferred over to 144.6 on the 2 metre band. Now I've put the uh, super gainer up. That should work for 2 and 70s. So I'm going to give it a try in 2 metres now. 
M0 Golf Echo Tango calling on 144600. Anybody about? I think you might be here, Ken and Andy, possibility. 280 Golf in your return, and I got you, Paul. Yeah, I've got you, Andy. Signal's a little bit less on two metres for some reason, but uh, apart from that, mate, you're coming in nice and clear. Good audio, five and nine. Yeah, I got you, four and five, yeah. Yeah, I'm a little bit away from the microphone because I'm filming the front of the radio, so I'm a little bit away from the, uh, the radio. I forgot to bring a microphone with me, but that's part of the fun of radio, I suppose, forgetting stuff and then remembering you forgot it. Yeah, yeah, no worries, mate, yeah. When you get time, bud, send me make a model of that uh, photo mic that you've got, the camera mic, and uh, I'll see about picking one up. Yeah, I certainly will do, mate. When I get back home, I'll uh, photograph it and send it to you, and if I can find a link, I'll send you one of those as well. So, uh, yeah, no problem there, mate. I'll do that when I get back home. Yeah, you're going, Ken. Yeah, signal seven, Paul. Audio's quiet, but you've explained why. Yeah, signal seven, Paul. Are you still on that one that's cut for 435 or have you changed antenna? I'm on what's called a... Let me just tell you the name of it and I'll come back to you. Flower pot. The antenna up there is a 2 and 70s slim gainer. And it's taped onto the top just to stop it sliding back down through the tubing with the uh, coax that's attached to it. I'm using the 213 coax and again onto this stand get me balance <laughs> and that's what we've used today so we did have a good couple of contacts on two meters with good signal reports so quite pleased about that very little activity on two when i called cq but ain't that just the way you know you get a day to play radio and every bugger else is doing something else For those that have never been up to shire oaks pit top or pit tip whatever you want to call it Bit of trees behind us, a good bit of open space to the front. And of course, playing radio, get yourself an antenna up there. Oh yeah, over, over. Please check out my friend Rob's page and also his um, YouTube channel, which is Rico's Electronic Repairs. And also check us out on this page as well. Remember, if you like what we're doing here, please give us a like and subscribe. And thank you very, very much. 1010. Till we do it again.